Thank you for joining us. Today we are discussing the dynamic brake system used in many Packer winch products. Many of our winches and hoists have a dual braking system consisting of a static brake, which was discussed in an earlier video, and a dynamic braking system. The dynamic braking system uses hydraulic fluid trapped between the hydraulic motor and the brake valve. Hydraulic fluid is very difficult to compress, which allows this action to be performed very smoothly. This is all controlled by the Braden brake valve. After the static brake opens when lowering or paying out a load, hydraulic fluid is still trapped by a spool in the brake valve. However, all hydraulic motors have some internal leakage which may allow the load to drift. When the operator directs the winch or hoist to pay out or lower faster, increased pressure shifts the valve spool in the brake valve. This releases the trapped hydraulic fluid allowing the winch or hoist to pay out or lower faster. The speed of paying out or lowering is controlled by the brake valve orifice and the shifting of the brake valve spool modulated by the spring. To ensure your safety and maximize hours of operations, do not shock weld the winch or hoist. Also, proper oil maintenance is required. For additional information, contact your local distributor or go to PackerWinch.com.